Oh, David says, when drawing wire down from a cast ingot, how close to the target diameter would you roll it in the square rollers? Okay. I would roll it down. Say you want to draw down one millimeter wire. I would take it down to about 1.1 minimum. Or is it maximum? Yeah. So I wouldn't take it down any further than 1.1, 1.2 millimeters because I always like to take it down to the draw plate, perhaps two or three times down to the final diameter. So if you're using a two millimeter round wire, I would take it down square to about say 2.2 and then take it then through the draw plate to say three or four times just to take it down then to the, the size required. If you take it down to, this is the problem, and Louise found uh, this bit of a problem um, when she was doing some, some square wire is that when you put the square wire through the rolls it doesn't always end up square so even though your square wire should be square when you're taking it down through your uh, rolling mill it never is it's always slightly and i'll exaggerate this it's always more like that it's not quite like that, but it's always like that. It's never the right, it's always, and then if you tr do try and then roll it, you'll end up rolling the wire then, oh, come on, Andrew, seriously, that the wire will end up rolling like this, and then if you want to desection it, it doesn't desection right. So quite often you've got to keep putting your square piece of wire through the grooves in the rolling mill quite a few times at the same distance. So without adjusting the top, so the rolls don't move. Put it, keep putting it through, bringing it out, turn it 90 degrees, put it through, bring it out 90 degrees, put it through, bring it out 90 degrees, and keep doing that a few times. And eventually your square wire will end up square. Because what I'm saying is that if you try and measure uh, past the diameter here, it may be slightly the diameter, but distance across the flats, DIF, uh, DAF, um, the distance here may not be the same as that distance there. So I always stop, say, to do 2.2 millimetres and I'll say square and then I can draw it down to 2 millimetres round. So if there is any discrepancy in my square, I know I've got a fifth of a millimetre to play around with before I get down to that. Take it down to two mil, and if one of these is perhaps is, is, is 1.9 and that's two millimeters, but well then it's, it's too small. You've gone too small already. So take it down to about a fifth of a mini, millimeter bigger than what you need it, draw it down to the required size. Long answer, apologies for that. Mm -hmm.